What's up guys, it's Rick Plastic and I am bringing you guys another Black Ops 2 video, this time on the map, on the map Nuketown. Uh, I got a swarm this gameplay, so that's why I thought I would share it with you guys. I was playing with a Vector Silencer, uh, Fast Max, and then I was playing with a bunch of perks. Wait, I was Scavenger, Toughness, Ghost Hardline and um, Dexterity, and I wasn't uh, playing with any secondary weapons or technicals or lethal or anything like that but i don't want to talk about the gameplay i want to talk about the camos the camos in black ops 2 um i think they did a really good job by implementing challenges again uh in for gaining any uh, camos uh because now you have a goal when you're playing with a certain gun to get a certain camo and also the diamond camo is a really good thing that they implemented it in the game because now you also have a goal to play with a certain clause and just focus on that clause and get like diamond camo on uh, on, your, on your submachine guns or assault rifles or those special classes like shotguns, well no, shotgun isn't really special but uh, yeah, secondary guns or um, what's it called, special uh, class, uh, crossbow and shit, those things but I, what I do regret um, that they didn't implement in Black Ops 2 is the face paints I know it may sound a little bit ridiculous because um, you don't really saw it um, so clearly on Black Ops 1 when someone had a face paint, but I do think it makes it makes you, you kind of special. Um, so that's that's pretty a shame they didn't implement it in Black Ops 2, but they certainly certainly did a good job with the camos because in Black Ops 1 everyone was just um, playing with the Tiger camo, you just had to buy it with fucking cut points. Um, there wasn't any goal or achievement whatsoever, so uh, they did a really good job in Black Ops 2. I can't give you guys my opinion about MW3, but I guess they also did like camo challenges like in MW2, but I'm not sure because I haven't played it for I haven't played for like so long, and I only was like level 50, no prestige or anything. So I hope you guys enjoyed the swarm. Uh, I died because there was a fucking noob camping in a fucking corner in fucking Nuketown. I mean, it was just sitting. I have to I have to admit that uh, the players were really bad, but he was just like sitting in the corner. You will see it at the end. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, this is going to all. This is always going to end. So I'm going to wrap up here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give the like if you enjoyed watching. Uh, subscribe if you haven't yet to my channel. You will expect some more videos coming. And yeah, um, yeah. Peace out, niggas.